today in this video we are going to see about uh, civil pressure code 1908 and in which we are going to take the topic transfer of suits which is dealt by section 22 to 25 22 23 24 25 so we are going to see four sections maradal um, so or suit or court il irundhu innoru court irk maatrapada vendiya nirbandham enna enna endru inda 22 section 22 lende 25 paarkirukindrom poduvaga oru valakku or court alladhu irandu alladhu merpatta court ilil jurisdiction irundal adanai edho or court il maatruvarkana adhigaram undu adu poduvaga plaintiff therndikkar or court ai anda court ai perumbalum adanai maatra mudiyadu aanalum thevai pattal defendant application kuduthu adanai or court ilindhu innor court irkku maatralam adai patti nam paarkirukindrom so this is about transfer of suits under under what condition under what context the case can be civil case can be transferred from one court to another court that we are going to see in this video first right to choose the court usually the transfer uh, withdrawal of uh, suits or appeals and other proceedings from one court to another court is dealt in section 22 to 25 mat uh, maarudalukkagavo allathu vidra case vidra seivadarkago allathu uh, appeal seivadarkago nam or court irundhu innor court irukku valakai thodara inda 22 25 22 lende 25 section uh, civil procedure code urimeyil valakku uh, adhigaram kudikirathu so usually the plaintiff has dominant litis so as a dominant person for litigation the plaintiff uh, right to choose the co any court so he has the right to choose any court uh, however this right to choose the court is uh, not uh, absolute in, uh, or arbitrary is not arbitrary or absolute or uncontrolled in appropriate cases in some of the cases though the plaintiff has right to choose uh, any, any court uh, he has uh, have all liberty to choose that court um, however it is not absolute or arbitrary so on the request of defendant the case can be transferred from one court to another court on giving an application to the um, competent court or higher courts uh, that is uh, so a superior court may transfer a case so particularly the important thing a superior court may transfer a case pending in one court to another court so the transfer power is uh, the transfer power lies with higher court now we'll see uh, uh, one by one sections section 22 that is power to transfer suits uh, be instituted in more than one court whenever the suits can be instituted in one or two or more than one court uh, that is they, then they can have they, they can tra um, transfer the case in any you know, other court that is that that is the the provision has been laid down in section 22 where the suits may be uh, instituted in one or two or more courts and is instituted on one such court the defendant may apply to have the suit the defendant may have uh, apply to have the suit transferred to one such court that is the defendant may apply to have suit transferred to another court uh, that uh, that is we are going to see a case study also so the defendant can give an application to transfer the case which is instituted by the plaintiff so usually the plaintiff chooses the court but uh, the defendant can also um, have a um, request to change the court on 
uh, at certain grounds. We are going to see a case study. Lalita A. Ranga versus Ajay Champala Ranga. All India Report 2000, uh, Supreme Court, page number 23406. And then in this case, uh, what is the uh, problem in this case? The difficult is faced by the um, petitioner wife, that is the defendant. So what she uh, had a difficulty, she was uh, um, uh, a, a British, uh, she was uh, employed in um, that is Rajasthan, and then the court they uh, it is about the divorce between uh, her husband and uh, uh, wife. Actually, the wife was uh, working in Rajasthan. The case was instituted in Bombay. And she had a small kid, kid also. Uh, so in such cases, uh, she gave a petition uh, to Bombay stating that I cannot uh, come from all along from Rajasthan to Bombay to attend the divorce uh, case. Hence, it has to be transferred to uh, Rajasthan in, uh, so that she can attend the case in Rajasthan. So such was the so the divorce petition shall tra stand transferred from so that uh, naturally that was transferred from um, Bombay to Jaipur. So according to the convenience of the um, that is the defendant, the case was transferred because the genuinity was there. Considering the genuinity, the case was transferred from Bombay to Jai uh, Bombay to Jaipur. Then section 23 to which court application lies, where application can be given. Section 23 provides forum and uh, specifies the court in which an application for transfer may be made. So the section 23 provides in which court the transfer petition can be given. And uh, the several courts have in jurisdiction. Naturally, when a uh, uh, case is instituted, the, um, the jurisdiction is in, in many, many court that is having jurisdiction or subordinate courts to an appellate court. So naturally, when the subordinate court uh, is having the petition and the appellate court, one appellate court, an application for transfer uh, be made to appellate court. So, when the uh, uh, case is uh, instituted in subordinate court, a tra transfer application can be made to the appellate court and the court may transfer a case, the appellate court may transfer a case from one court to another court. So, that is the section 23. Section 24, what the section 24 says, general power of transfer and withdrawal. So, generally, uh, who can uh, transfer or withdraw the case that is the high court and district court have the power to um, transfer and withdraw the case uh, the transfer the high court and district court are given general power of transfer and withdrawal of cases either on an application so an application has to be made to transfer the case from a district court to subordinate court or other court or high court to other courts uh, of any of the parties after issuing notice and hearing them. So after giving notice and hearing them the case can be transferred. Then uh, grounds for transfer of suits. So on certain grounds only the case can be transferred. When the, um, the one, one is apprehension of injustice in the court even when the parties feel that there is some injustice can be done in the court then the transfer application can be made then if uh, the suit is uh, then uh, judges having peculiar interest suppose if uh, they suspect the fidelity uh, of the judges and pecuniary uh, is involved then the transfer application can be made uh, and uh, withdrawal of case either on an application of any of the parties after issuing a notice or 
then ground now we are going to see the grounds first thing the apprehension of injustice in the court and second judges having peculiar interest the third one is joint trial uh, uh, avoid multiple so when a joint trial can be done so to avoid multiplicity of cases and also convenience of parties that is the parties uh, uh, as per the convenience of the parties the case can be transferred and uh, location of uh, people and uh, location of proper um, places suppose if the locality is something different and the case is situated somewhere else the transfer can be um, can, can be made and then location of residence of parties and uh, as we said already the location of the party defendant is somewhere else and the case has been instituted somewhere else then uh, transfer can be asked so these are all the grounds for transfer of suits when there is the ground for transfer the the, the transfer application can be made the, they are one is injustice if they feel injustice operation of injustice in the court and pecuniary bias and then if at all if uh, uh, multiple to avoid multiple of cases and convenience of parties the location and residence of the parties considering all these things the transfer application can be made and then section 25 power of supreme court to transfer suits so this is with regard to the power of supreme court to transfer suits so on an application of a party any uh, and after notice to the parties so on an application and notice to the parties and after uh, hearing such of uh, uh, such of the, the, the such of them the supreme court may at any stage if satisfied uh, this uh, section is expedient to meet the um, court of uh, justice that is the ends of justice to meet the ends of justice di- direct that any suit appeal or proceeding be tried to high court or other civil courts in the state or to other states so whenever uh, they feel if satisfied and is expedient to meet the ends of justice the supreme court can order to transfer the case to uh, any one of the civil court in the state uh, that is the section 25 states so this uh, provision has been laid down to transfer the suit if at all if the court is satisfied that can be transferred to district or subordinate courts by the supreme court uh, on giving a petition by the affected party and after hearing them so these are all the conditions for transfer of suits from one court to another court tamil le solla ponal oru valakanadu todarpattu anda valaku jurisdiction adu adudey எல்லையானது கோ அந்த வழக்குடைய எல்லையானது இரண்டு ஒன்றுக்கு ஒரு கோர்ட்டு அல்லது இரண்டு அல்லது அதுக்கு மேற்பட்டான கோர்ட்டுகளில் தொடரப்படலாம் என்று இருந்தால் அப்பொழுது இந்த வழக்கை மாறுவது மாற்றுவதற்கு மாற்றம் செய்யலாம் என்ற அதிகாரத்தை கொடுக்கின்ற இந்த செக்ஷன் இருபத்தி ரெண்டு இருபத்தி மூணு இருபத்தி நாலு இருபத்தஞ்சி கிரிமினல் ப்ரொசீஜர் கோட்லே வழங்கப்பட்ட வழங்கப்பட்டுள்ளது அதில் பொதுவாக அந்த கேஸினுடைய கருத்தை கொண்டு அது அதை அதன் மீது உள்ள சாரத்தின் முத கொண்டு ஒரு ஒருவர் வழக்கு தொடரும்போது இன்னொருவரும் அதை இப்போ டிஃபெண்டண்ட் இருக்கின்றார் பிளான்டிஃப் இருக்கின்றார் இவருடைய சௌகரியத்தின் பேரிலே அது நியாயமாகப்பட்டால் அது அந்த வழக்கை பிளான்டிஃப் தொடுத்த வழக்கை ஒரு கோர்ட்டில் தொடுகிறார் என்றால் அந்த வழக்கை வேறு இடத்தில் டிஃபெண்டண்ட் கே கேட்டு அது மாற்றப்படலாம் என்ற அடிப்படையில் அமைந்தது செக்ஷன் டுவெண்ட்டி டூ டுவெண்ட்டி த்ரீ டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபோர் டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபைவ் வித் திஸ் வி கன்க்ளூட் திஸ